one of the charges is going to be not having a valid registration on your car. Okay? One of the ways that we prove that is the, dry, the license plates that you have on your car are not valid. Okay. Well, so, I, I don't understand the charges that y'all are bringing against me because I don't understand all the legalese and the words and the terms as far as it goes to the court. I just want to tell you that as part of the evidence process for those charges, we're taking your license plates. Oh, so you're going to take the plates? Yep. So you're going to so confiscate my property? If when you go to court, if you decide you're going to go to court, have to go to court, it's a required mandatory court date. When you go there, talk to the judge. If he says you get them back, you get them back. But until that time, they're going to go into evidence. What is it? Uh, just wait. Something cool is going to happen. Uh. And welcome to Facts or Frauds. And we head back to Colorado for Mr. Garcia and another traffic stop. This time, who failed? Let me know in the comments. Hello. How's it going, officer? Why don't we come all the way back here? Um, I just wanted to park on some private property where I feel safe and comf and okay, safe and comfortable, sir. It was just, it was just strange. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. I just, I just wanted to find the most uh spot, the a uh, parking spot where I felt comfortable. You okay. know, oh. where that. I was just wondering. I was like, where? Yeah, no, I didn't, I didn't want it to make it seem suspicious or okay. at all or anything like that, sir. Okay. Officer. Well, you obviously know the reason I stopped you. There's no plates on the vehicle. I understand what you're gonna say. Do you have a driver's license? Okay, so it is to my understanding under the it's been upheld by the Supreme Court and it's, it's uh, under the law of the land under common law that we have um, a God given a God given right to travel on the public highways untaxed without license registration or plates on a vehicle as long as I'm driving pri privately I'm not engaged in commerce officer I get you. okay you know I want to be calm and cordial and respectful Me to too. you I don't want to be belligerent I'm I don't want no problems sir calm, cool, collective right I, right I don't want no problems with okay. you officer all right I don't want no problems well if you don't want problems how about registering your car and having a license plate just an idea uh I'm just Driving back. I'm just driving. I mean, not driving. You see, this is legally terms. <laughs> yeah, these are legally terms. Uh, I'm traveling it. home. Um, I was from another location. I'm traveling home right now. I'm not engaged in commerce. Okay. This property, this property right here, is not engaged in commerce. I'm not engaged in. Um, uh, I'm not traveling with any goods products i'm not an uber driver i'm not a taxi driver i'm not a bus driver i'm not engaged in any of that so i know and i know my rights to my understanding that i'm not required to have any license registration or insurance in order for me to travel from point a point to point b okay. it's been a god given right that's been upheld in the supreme court wrong 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 and the law of the land and if you want to press charges with me officer Listen, I'm just I just thought because you had no plate. Yeah, I know. I, I completely okay. understand. Thank you. Uh, on you, right? Yeah, no, I, I, I've been... It's... Do anything crazy. No, no, right. I, and I... I'm out here. No, and I... I DUI enforcement. Right, I, and I completely respect you that you haven't made it, jumped to any conclusions because I've already had this experience many times with many other officers and my experiences have not been pleasant. <laughs> So I'm just trying to articulate myself to the best of my abilities okay. and I want to demonstrate to you that I'm a uh, um, I don't think I'm above the law. I know that as long as I'm not creating any loss, injury or harm or I'm not in the danger to the public and I'm not doing anything bad and I have I'm not I'm not I, there's no evidence of me in a commission of a crime or a bad committed crime or uh, or ain't no evidence of me committing a crime. I know as, if, as long as there's nothing of that sort. I know that I'm fine and it's well with my rights to travel from point A to point B, officer. I hear you. But do you also understand where our beliefs are different? Not our beliefs, but our my requirement to enforce the law and your beliefs on how you interpret the law, right? 
Well, I mean, and I, 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 you, you probably been in, ran into this a bunch of times, right? Driving around with no plates. I'm just saying, I have a thing to do, just like you are saying that you understand the law one way. Yeah, I mean, I mean, at, the uh, yeah, at the, I mean, at the end of the day, the thing is, what do you want to do here? Because I want to talk to you as a man. What? You know, I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to act like this. Uh, the suit that you have on is creating any kind of clout or judgment. I want to talk to you respectfully as a man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see, butthead, I told you. See, this guy's making sense. So it's to my understanding, and I have continued to do it. And if, you, if regardless, if you want to put some charges on me, I will end I up. I'd rather not write you a ticket. Yeah, if, yeah, cause I, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't want no, I don't want no harm done to nobody. I have no ill will intent. I'm in so good faith, clean love, hands. Can you love it with me? Okay. Um, wh wh what did you want to ask, you? officer? What did you want to ask, officer? Can I get your name and date of birth? Run your VIN. If everything's clear, I'm gone. Okay. Now I've had I already had many bad experiences uh, okay. giving you I mean giving officers my name, okay. and when I say my name, I do understand that nowadays y'all like to use uh, our legal fiction name and put liens against that name, which is a public charge. Drugs are bad. You shouldn't do drugs. Okay. And you know that way that takes a lot of time, energy, and a lot of quote unquote a labor out of my time and day and it's depleting me and it's wasting and draining me and i understand yeah. that this is all a, a business game this is nothing strictly business nothing personal i completely understand that i i i would prefer not to provide you any form of identification but if is it if it isn't horrible i've left the vin uncovered mm -hmm. you can run the vin number this car is not stolen i have no problem with you running the vin number this is private property. No, I purchased it. Saying, has it ever been registered before? No, I uh, I have not registered it. Okay. So I've maintained it in uh, private means. Okay. For private means. I have not registered it. I have not gotten license for it. Okay. And I, I'm not in no contract with the state of Colorado to give you jurisdiction. I don't have, a, a, I don't need, I don't even want to say I don't have a license, but I don't have that contract. Uh, for y'all to subject me to that jurisdiction. You don't think they have jurisdiction? Yeah, okay. Then don't show up to court on the 18th. See what happens. So, uh, you're more than welcome to run the plates. Okay. I mean, not the plates, the VIN number. Yeah, yeah, I get what you're saying. Um, this car's not stolen. I purchased it privately. Other than that, I feel very um, uncomfortable providing my personal information. Especially if I know that it will be used against me in the court of law especially with all the bad experiences that i have with um policy enforcement um i just feel very comfortable not I'm providing not information. Information anything but i have to figure out who, not, who is driving the vehicle and that's and the I thing understand you're saying you're not driving yeah this is not a vehicle it is a vehicle. No, a, a, a vehicle is classified as somewhat a uh, property engaged in commerce. This property is not engaged in commerce, officer. Okay, this is an automobile. It's, it was first considered an automobile, and once yes. people decided to register it, it became a motor vehicle. So this is not a motor vehicle. I um, classify this as an automobile, okay. private transportation through private means. Sorry, I got some seats in my mouth. No, it's okay. It's okay. And... Um, so, it is to my... Let me run the VIN real quick, okay? Okay. Yeah. Five minutes later. All right. I'm not even going to try to push this issue. All right? You're driving with no plates. It's a simple $25 ticket if I order a ticket. Yet. I'm not going to sit here. You have your beliefs. We have our laws we have to enforce. We're just going to put it as, what is it? A agree to disagree? Agree to disagree. Part. The reason I stopped you was you had no plates, okay? That's the, the reason for the stop. There's my card. Got it. All right. Look your turn. You have a good day. Keep doing what you're doing. All right. Thank you, officer. You can't fix stupid. And thanks for joining us on Facts Your Frauds. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button, you're subscribed, and ring that bell for notifications so the next time I premiere a video, you can be in the live chat with everyone else and leave a comment in the comment section and tell them what you think.
And a huge thank you to our channel members, Robert Morley, Andy, Chris Kelling, Goddess of Truth, Pedro Wagamole, CW 1960, Existential Angst, Pats Cats, Butcher Bird, West Side Girl Reacts, Jason Eden, and Buddy Parker. If you'd like to become a member, just hit that join button right next to subscribe, or click on the link in the description. And if you're still hanging around, thank you. I appreciate you all. Why not hit that thumbs up button, subscribe, and ring that bell. And also leave a comment in the comment section tell me what you think. If you'd like to support the channel, hit that super thanks button. Until next time, I'll see you soon.